Vehicle is pitching downrange. Booster engine cut off. Ship ignition. Stage separation confirmed. Boost back burn start up. Excitement, so right here, this is... <laughs> This is our view of the jettisoned hot stage. Uh, as we mentioned, this is a temporary fix to help uh, reduce the weight of the booster. Uh, so we have the super heavy booster. Future iterations will have a lighter weight integrated hot stage structure that won't need to be jettisoned. To guide the booster, and there's that landing gun. That landing bird just begun. And you can see the water below. And we have Splashdown. What an incredible sight. Congratulations to the SpaceX team. Re-entry, an awesome view that we have here. Starship Orion, this, is the, this is the same view that we had when we first uh, returned from the coast phase. Again, this is looking at the side of one of the flaps. And can, we, it's incredible that literally at the bottom of this picture, we're basically looking through plasma, <laughs> which is just absolutely mind-blowing. Wild, very wild. Now we are expecting Entry to begin here in about 30 seconds or so. Entry to Splashdown is expected to last about six Expect minutes long. Marishes. And that flip maneuver should occur around uh, about 10 minutes before Splashdown. And such incredible views Starship that we're getting. approaching peak heating region. And great call outs there. Yeah, these views are absolutely Astounding. Most um, temperatures continue to rise with an expected reason. Uh, the, the attitude of the vehicle as it re-enters. The uh, uh, Starliner and the International Space Station now all talking on one I mean, big not loop. Just camera the teams have both go for integrated operations. And We're going to start dropping precipitously. We're going to start getting to, to transonic pretty soon. After and then after that, we'll get into subsonic, where we're, we're moving less than the speed of sound. but. This camera view is looking right at one of the, the forward flaps. And we're, we're strategically putting some cameras around the vehicle to just look at the, the different areas. That Looks like we've got the flap starting to come apart a little. Yeah, it does appear that we have a little bit of burn through there. We can see pieces of the vehicle flying off. What a show it has been. It's been like watching Interstellar or something. <laughs> this is wild to see this, but the ship is still coming down, which is incredible to see. How far can it go? That is the question.
exhaustion. <laughs> Keep your eye on the altitude in the bottom right hand corner. We're at 54 kilometers right here, now. Uh, up to the right. And now, ultimately, Russia. the that data is, is the payload today. We've today. been saying it multiple Advanced times. We're, the, you know, our right teams are, is, are sitting, the uh, reviewing the data live, learning you know, the voice where the hot spots are. As you can see, there's an obvious hot spot there with the flap. And learning how we can improve this design. The goal was to get as far through this high high heat re-entry as possible. Ideally, we'd love to make it all the way down and perform <laughs> that, uh, that landing burn and flip maneuver, but we may not get that far today. We will see. Well, we see the same. This is a nail biter. <laughs> But we are, uh, unfortunately, we can't see through the through the, the, the lens, but we're still getting the feed. Uh, Starship is now uh, 11 kilometers over the ocean. All this data is incredibly important. Even if, uh, you know, it breaks up right now. Okay, we can see that flap actuating through the glass. Okay, the next milestone will be initiation of the flip maneuver and landing bird. Uh, Keep an eye on the bottom right corner you know of your screen for those that three center card, engines sure to the center light. They will gimbal so or uh, angle so that the ship flips itself back up yeah, vertical and hopefully lands in a vertical position. And the crowd is very excited to get this view of that flap still maneuvering. to the approach lip slide until after the TPI. This is incredible. We're getting very close to splashdown. These fireflies are such a good sign of life right now. We wish we could see more, but we'll take it. Yeah, no. Uh, we can go ahead. two kilometers of altitude, terminal block. Landing boom startup for Starship. All right, good news there. Landing as part of the, the landing bird shutdown was commanded. Uh, that camera will be used more as the crew gets a little bit closer to the station. Mm -hmm.